Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wise official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Sister Wives star Cody Brown isn't ready to restore his ties with his other children after the loss of his estranged son Garrison, who passed away earlier this month. Cody is not okay at all, he's retreated utterly, an insider revealed to an outlet. He gets into dark places when he gets upset, so he's just in a very dark place right now. At this point, Cody's boys and other kids are not going to be receptive to him now because they just lost a family member, the insider stated. It's going to take even more work for Cody to fix the damage he's done. He's not even thinking about chances of reconciliation, the person stated. He's still processing Garrison's death and grieving his loss. The insider also added that the Brown family patriarch's mental health is affecting his marriage and actually causing problems, referring to Cody's only remaining wife, Robin, 45, who he spiritually wed in 2010 and officially married in 2014. He sort of put up this wall and is internalizing his feelings, the person added. He's focused more on himself and moving on. Hashtag, I don't think they will ever divorce unless he continues what he is doing and pushes her out, the source pointed out. Cody just disappears, and when he gets frustrated, he blames her for his troubles. So, right now, he's doing that with her. Garrison was certified dead on Tuesday, March 5, after he was found by his younger brother Gabriel, 22. His death was deemed a suicide by self-inflicted gunshot wound. As O.K. has revealed, Cody ties with Gabrielle and Garrison, as well as his child Leon, who he shared with ex-Mary, were highly difficult. The father of 18 was not on speaking terms with them before to Garrison's passing. Honestly, I can't even recall the last time they saw each other. From what I know, the last time they actually had an interaction was when they met up and had a big confrontation on camera. A separate insider added, Cody pushed his family away for a very long period. These two guys have at the front line of the anguish. Garrison Brown's siblings are hoping to assist continue on their late brother's aspirations after his untimely death by suicide. The Sister Wives star was confirmed dead on Tuesday, March 5, when his younger brother Gabriel, 22, found him at his flagstaff Ariz home. Police swiftly concluded that he'd taken his own life via a self-inflicted gunshot. While Garrison, real name Robert Garrison Brown, had been a member of the Nevada National Guard since 2015, he also launched a Hawaiian-style clothing business called Bob's Floral in 2020. However, shortly after introduction, it was reported the shop was temporarily on pause. He was definitely planning on working on his clothing, but before his death, he wasn't really doing much of anything, truthfully, a source close to the Brown family stated to a news site. He was depressed and was unhappy, and he didn't feel like he was getting much success from anything, the person added, saying there weren't really any announcements of any plans coming for the firm. But now, oddly enough, there's conversations within the family about how they're going to try to keep his legacy alive, the source stated, they plan on carrying on some of his dreams, which can be done by his brothers. The insider also stated the Brown family had been discussing about creating a foundation for Garrison, which may potentially be centered on animal rescue given to the late 25-year-old's fondness for cats. The former reality star got his three kitties, Kafu, Patches O'Houlihan, and nine-year-old Miss Buttons, from local rescues in the Flagstaff area and often uploaded images of them on his social media. They're going to turn what happened into a positive, the person stated. As OK, previously reported, High Country Humane Animal Shelter honored Garrison by dedicating their cat adoption area after the late warrior. Garrison's unwavering love for cats was a heartfelt passion, they stated in their announcement in mid-March. We look forward to giving the plaque and room naming during our five-year anniversary and founder's celebration. Garrison's legacy is one of kindness, laughter, and unconditional love. His soul lives on in every meow, in every snub-lap sleep, 
and in the purring pleasure of the cats he loves. Sister wife star Janelle Brown took a minute to celebrate late son Garrison's 26th birthday one month after he tragically died by suicide. The mother of six, who also shares kids Logan, Madison, Hunter, Gabrielle and Savannah with ex Cody Brown, took to Instagram on Wednesday, April 10, to share a slideshow of photographs and videos of earlier celebrations. Happy birthday, sweetheart, she captioned the image. We are missing you dearly today. It's hard to think you aren't here anymore. We talked a lot about you today and even went to Texas Roadhouse for dinner, your favorite place, she continued. I still feel you nearby sometimes, and I'm grateful we shall meet each other again when my adventure is over. Fans flooded the comments area with condolences and words of love for Garrison and the Brown family. Sweet Robert Garrison Brown, I'm sure you can see now just how many hearts you've captured and how many lives you've impacted, human and animal alike, one user penned. Happy birthday. Rest in paradise. A second wrote, I'm so sorry, Janelle. My condolences to you and your family. Then a third chimed in, What a precious young man. We love you, Janelle. A fourth follower informed the heartbroken mother. We are all strangers to you, I know, but just know you are in our prayers. As OK, previously reported, Garrison was declared dead on Tuesday, March 5, when his body was discovered at his flagstaff Ariz, home by his younger brother Gabriel. Police concluded his cause of death was a self-inflicted gunshot wound and both Gabriel and a roommate told them Garrison had been suffering with alcohol and depression. Sister wives actor Garrison Brown's death has officially been deemed a suicide. In a statement made on Thursday, April 4, the Flagstaff Police Department said the case is no longer under investigation at this time and has been closed. Flagstaff PD noted, there was no foul play and it was not a homicide. He took his own life. Although the investigation is over, the police and the Brown family are still waiting to receive the medical examiner's report to clarify whether or not there were any drugs or alcohol in his system when he went. A private funeral for family only took place on Friday, March 8, according to one of Garrison's cousins who paid a moving tribute to him. Everyone was hugging and weeping up. It was the toughest thing any of them have ever had to do, but sharing tales about Garrison helped them get through it. A separate insider said of the tribute, Everyone hopes Garrison's found the peace that seemed to elude him in life. On Sunday, March 24, Garrison's military service was honored at a ceremony that took place at the Clark County Armory in Nevada. His mother, Janelle, was pictured teary-eyed when she was handed her late son's flag. It's been hard to get my brain to work correctly again. I'm so appreciative for the outpouring of love and support I've gotten these last three weeks, she posted on Instagram following the service. The support has been incredible. I am honored. So many of you shared stories of your loved ones. So many of you wrote of your thoughts and prayers, she said. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Garrison was honored by family members and by his National Guard unit last Sunday at a celebration of life ceremony, the mother of six stated. He would have loved it. I am sharing some of the images. Many people have already seen a lot of them online, frequently with sarcastic comments accompanying them. But this was a fantastic moment for us. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.